826 is pretty empty, but the tolls are still in force, which is kind of wrong, I think. Normally in an emergency situation, tolls should be suspended, especially for people having a hardship right now, losing their jobs and loss of income, which is affecting all of us. They should at least cancel the tolls. Germatron, I wish you would have made it, buddy. You inspired this uh, pandemic ride. So definitely a lot less traffic, a lot less traffic. This is 7th Street, right next to 8th Street, which is Calle Ocho, and also known as Little Havana. On Calle Ocho is where they celebrate the Cuban uh, festival called Calle Ocho in March, and that was also canceled because of the uh, current situation. I can't let that scooter show me up. Even though I think it's a Yamaha Zumo, that explains all the power. currently riding my new to me Yamaha Super Tenere 2017 also known as Magnus so I'll take this time to uh, let you all know that I feel fine my loved ones are all safe and feel fine and no issues with the uh, current situation so for all you guys subscribers friends family that are watching this video so far everything's a-okay it's really hard to accept the fact how this, how this is quarantine is so psychological. Right now I'm, I'm thinking of uh, possibly vis visiting some friends that live around here or telling one of my buddies to meet me, I don't know, Cafe 27 or anywhere. And, uh, and you really can't do any of those things. I guess we could meet at a distance because we're totally safe on the motorcycle as far as uh, you know what is concerned. Cherokee Red Ale. I'm gonna save this for later. I really can't say the word. You know what I am talking about, all of you. But YouTube will flag this uh, e this uh, video if uh, if its robots think it's inappropriate for the current situation. But all of you know, all of you that watch my videos are extremely smart people. I would say almost everything is closed. And the restaurants that are opened are just allowing takeout and delivery. All of the supermarkets I've been to or that I know of that friends have been to are all open. And there's no real shortage of uh, really anything except for toilet paper. Here in South Florida, what we're used to when uh, emergency situations happen is usually almost always a hurricane or a hurricane that's coming and what happens is all the water a lot of the basic uh, stuff from the supermarkets gets totally bought up in a, in a heartbeat and the Home Depot is totally packed and the gas stations they run out of gas every single one so here none of that in this situation all the gas stations are running normally plenty of gasoline just a few items in the shopping uh, in the uh, supermarkets that's the only thing that I've noticed and obviously you can't really uh, sit down anywhere and have a, a meal all the drive throughs are open at the major fast food chains I just bought an 18 pack of Stella or twist at the supermarket there was plenty of beer one of the guys I won't mention any names me deal in our little group put out today a, a fake news saying that starting tomorrow the governor of Florida isn't allowing any more uh, sales of beer or alcohol so I kind of panicked a little bit there and I uh, I went to the store and got a 18 pack better to be safe than sorry guys okay so we're taking a little takeout now a little fish dip for tonight some nachos and a cold beer that I, uh, I got earlier today 
and just uh, keep surviving. Mark, if you watch this video, we're at Bahamas Fish Market in Miami. A little birdie told me you like this place. We're getting the fish dip to go, obviously, ordene para llevar only, only to go, take out through this little tiny window. And uh, yeah, little fish dip tonight with a cold beer, some nachos, and another one for the fish dip, just two, maybe three. Max three. Oye, dile que te dé un pomo grande, ¿no? Los vasitos de eso. A26 is pretty empty, but the tolls are still in force, which is kind of wrong, I think. Normally, in an emergency situation, tolls should be suspended, especially for people having a hardship right now, losing their jobs and loss of income, which is affecting all of us. They should at least cancel the tolls. The cruise industry is a big, big industry here in South Florida and uh, a lot of places in the world, but especially here in, in Fort Lauderdale in Miami, there's a lot of cruise, cruise ships and cruise companies. And if you look at the, uh, at the stock market, the stock prices on Royal Caribbean and Carnival, they are really, really low. For example, Royal Caribbean was at a high of 134 or 137 per share and it went down to $24 per share and is currently at 35 and it went up to 47 actually. So I'm gonna put a link to a Charles Schwab referral. If you use that link, you're gonna get at least between two to $500 in credit and I'll get a little credit too, which we could both help each other out. And if you have a little spare money, I personally, my humble opinion, for myself, I don't, I can't really recommend it, is buy some uh, cruise uh, stocks. I personally like Royal Caribbean because it's such a nice company compared to the other ones. So yeah, so uh, check that link out in the description, sign up, and you're gonna get at least $200. And I'll get something, I think 50 bucks or something. And buy yourself some, uh, some Royal Caribbean and when it goes back to normal you'll triple or quadruple your money if it does go back to normal. Currently riding through the city of Doral, Doral Police Department there and the Trump National Doral. I think that's a golf course or a resort. Golf course. Univision, one of the sources of uh, fake news here in South Florida and the rest of the world. This is 836 Dolphin Expressway. Here we have a better view of the airport on my left, at least for me. I'm not sure how well this is going to show in the video. Yeah, this wall is blocking here, but not much traffic at the airport either. And you can see here on 836, pretty much empty. Normally this road is bumper to bumper. Right here to my right is the Florida Outdoor Adventure Stadium. It's where the Florida Marlins play. Retractable roof, excuse me, I meant Marlins Park. I-95, very pleasurable at the moment to ride on. This is extremely bumper to bumper, all the time almost. Well guys, I'm gonna close the video off here. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little peek at a quarantine escape. I contaminated nobody. Please leave the hate comments to yourselves. If you're new to the channel, please uh, click subscribe, like the video if you like it. Let me know down below in your town or country how it is, how extreme the lockdown is. And I'll see you in the next video. Check out my Europe and Africa playlist so you can see the Canary Islands ride. It's an extremely beautiful islands. And I'm currently uploading those right now. Stay safe out there.